What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a while since I made a video, but here I am and today I want to share a small video of a little, almost like an unboxing. So this last weekend we had the Peterborough Tackle Swap and uh, I want to share with you guys some of the cool um, lures I picked up at the Peterborough Tackle Swap. And uh, this was a really cool show, you know, uh, after two years in the pandemic, we had a lot of shows canceled, but it was it was nice to you know finally be able to do an in-person show and see all the people that I haven't seen throughout the winter, right? So so starting with the stuff I got at the show, the first vendor I want to talk about is called Canadian Baits. He does uh, custom paint jobs on on his own swim baits and um, paddle tails. So this is the first one I got here. This essentially is an Arashi Glide. And what he did is he did his own uh, custom paint job on it. Did like a, I want to call it like a black carp, and he put these little, these yellow stripes on it. Looks really cool. I actually got this off the clearance bin because uh, he he was giving it for five dollars because the paint job got a little messed up. Uh, I don't know if the camera can catch it, but the yellow paint is cracking a little bit. And honestly, to me, that's that's not an issue. You know, just put some fresh hooks on this and fish it, and it'll be completely fine. And then from Canadian uh, baits again, I got these uh, like knockoffs, DRT Clash Nine almost. Like they they look similar to the real deal. They are knockoffs again with his his custom paint job. Here we have like a um, a sunfish pattern. Like just the, the detail in this paint job is amazing. We have another Clash Clash Nine knockoff. I got a loud, loud pink. Amazing lore. Uh, another swim baiter, which I was really impressed with his work. I gotta say, um, Hashimoto Concepts. Now the swim baits this guy was making is unreal. I obviously wasn't able to buy um, any of his swim baits because I wasn't really planning to spend a lot of money that day. I ended up spending more than I wanted to, but I did buy this little plastic shark this little thing is amazing if the camera can focus on it this little thing is so cool it's a little paddle tail shark about six inches long but look at the detail on that it is so cool it glows in the dark too um the pack came with two of these over twenty dollars and i'm telling you as soon as i get some money together i'm gonna be ordering lures from Hashimoto because i hope i'm saying the name right because the artwork is amazing. Again from Canadian Bates, another custom painted walker. It's like a purple, black, cherry almost color on this one. Really cool bait. The next vendor I want to shout out to, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen me shout out the JVM Custom Lures. Jeff custom paints these lures and he does a great job at them. He was at the fishing show. I picked up a, a square bill and a wake bait off him. An amazing job. And I also found this other um, wake bait that Jeff had with a little mouse pattern. That is so cool. Really good custom work job. So you guys probably know if you watch my, my YouTube videos that I enjoy throwing a swim jig. A swim jig is probably my favorite presentation, especially on these grassy lakes that we live on. So I went to Weapons of Bass Destruction and I loaded up on swim jigs, mostly because I did lose quite a few swim jigs last year from Pike. So I made sure I loaded up on swim jigs. This one's called the Fathead. We have the Sparkly Spec. Lavender Shad. Another Fathead. Gobi. Green Pumpkin Blue Hue. Also got a vibrating jig in the lavender shad color. And I got another vibrating jig. I can't remember what he called this color because there it is. It's a blood craw color. 
can see is that the orange and the reds. So I really like this brand. I like their product. They're, um, like I said, I love their swim jigs. And uh, I know I've been announcing, guys, that once I hit 1,000 subscribers, I'll be doing a giveaway. So I will be throwing two swim jigs from Weapons of Bass Destruction in the giveaway box. So keep that in mind. And of course, after buying all these lures, you cannot forget about Exxon Lures. Some of you guys know I work with Exxon Lures. So here we have that hot new product that's out in the market now, the Hot Shot Minnows. Here we have it in the uh, 309 color, Chartreuse Shad, and Hot Shot Minnow. So another cool thing I bought, Mixig Outdoors was there. He is a friend of mine. He competes in the kayak tournament series, and he's also uh, a, a, he has a YouTube channel and his own merch. So I went for his booth, and I got a Mixig Outdoors sun shirt. Look at that, guys. I'll be leaving a link for um, mostly everything you left here. Obviously, Exo Lures, Hashimoto Concepts, JVM Custom Lures, and Weapons of Bass Destruction. Now, just when I thought I was done shopping, I went to the East Hill Outdoors booth and they had a crazy sale on the uh, Daiwa Tatula Elite Reels. They were letting them go for 175 tax in. So, of course, I couldn't help myself. And we got our new Tatula Elite Reel. Isn't that cool? That is just, I don't know. To me, the Tatula uh, series of reels is, is my favorite. Can't go wrong with the Tula Elite, man. Just, it's a beautiful reel. It's amazing. Look at that. I got this one in a 6 3 to 1. Gonna be pairing it up with my Mega Bass Levante rod. It's gonna be such a great combo. Alright guys, that's it for my little unboxing video. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, quick video. I know I haven't seen you guys in a while, so it, was, it felt really good to be sitting here in front of the camera and talking to you guys. Thank you very much for joining the channel. Don't forget to subscribe, and uh, when we hit a thousand subscribers, we'll be doing a giveaway of lures that I like to use for bass fishing. Alright guys, thanks for tuning in. Have a good one. Cheers.